Everything in the body happens on a spectrum. It's not like you have diabetes or you don't. It's not a black and white thing. It happens on the spectrum. So your immune system and how autoimmune you are is also on a spectrum. That's why we have stages of autoimmunity. Stage one is silent. That's when you have antibody, but you don't have any symptoms. Stage two is autoimmune reactivity. That means you all have antibody and you also have symptoms because there's enough tissue destruction for you to fill it, but not enough to show up on MRI, CASCIN, lab studies. So then officially doctors say, well, you don't have autoimmune yet, but yet you don't feel good. And we also see antibody. And then stage three, the top of that is autoimmune disease. That's when you have antibody present, you have symptom, but also you have documented tissue destruction. Enough tissue has been destroyed by your immune system. And now they can pick it up on an endoscopy, x-ray can see documented damage of your cartilage on your joints for people with the rheumatoid arthritis. But by then it's too late, isn't it? So it works on a spectrum because you have stage one, two, and three. It progressively gets worse unless you do something to calm the immune system down.